strategy to fight the drought. The Placer County Water Agency is encouraging people to snitch using smartphones. KZRA3's Claire Duan tells us whether it's effective. And there's always usually a few weeds ha hanging around, too. Auburn resident Diane Berg cut down on her water usage by 30% in one year. I put in drip irrigation and took out the whole front yard. So when she heard about the PCWA phone app, she had no qualms about using it. I uh, see the same people gutter flooding every day, and so I decided I was going to give the app a try. Here's how it works. Somebody sees water being wasted, like this hose right here, that somebody forgot to turn off. They use the app to take a picture of the water. That picture goes back to the PCWA. They send somebody out and hopefully find the problem and are able to shut it off. The main benefit of the app is, is the uh, GPS coordinates, so we know exactly where to go. We can see the picture. While this app may be user friendly, it's been hard to get people to actually use it. I think it's just a matter of getting, uh, letting people know it's out there. It's still fairly new. The water agency has received almost 300 water wasting reports this year, but only 10% of those came from the app. And that may be because of people like Ed Ernst. I won't. I like my neighbors too much. They'd have to commit a felony before I said anything. The PCWA says this app is about water saving, not drought shaming. And they haven't fined anyone. This is really about education, not about penalizing, not about snitching. And people like Berg are glad this is one way to get other people to do their part during the drought. A neighbor up the hill that was walking or watering every day, um, haven't seen any water out there in a couple days now, so it's it has worked. In Placer County, Claire Duan, KCRA.